हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टेक नेट गाइड फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू कॉन्फ़िगर आईपीसी पी सी एक बिटवीन टू पॉल ऑल टू फायर ऑल सो फ्रेंड्स यू कैन सी इन दिस लैब वी आर गोइंग टू कॉन्फ़िगर आईपीसी पी सी एक बिटवीन टू पॉल ऑल टू फायर ऑल वी हैव ए साइट ए एंड साइड बी ऑन साइट ए माई लोकल सम्यूनिटी स्टैंड आउट वन डॉट वन जीरो स्लैश एंड साइड बी माई लोकल सम्यूनिटी ट्वेंटी डॉट वन डॉट वन डॉट जीरो स्लैश ट्वेंटी फोर साइट ए फायर ऑल पब्लिक इंटरफेस इज वन स्लेस से पब्लिक आई पी वन डॉट वन डॉट वन डॉट वन एंड ऑन साइट वी माई पब्लिक आई पी एड्रेस इज फाइव डॉट फाइव डॉट फाइव डॉट वन ओके इज कनेक्टेड बाई इंटरनेट हीयर ओके सो दिस इज माई साइट ए फायर ऑल दिस इज माई साइट वी फायर ऑल सो लेट्स यू कैन सी साइट ए फायर ऑल एंड साइट वी फायर ऑल सो फर्स्ट विल कॉन्फिगर साइट ए फायर ऑल so go to the network and you can see i have already configured interface here so eth1 110.1.1.1 and eth1/3 1.1.3 okay and eth1 this is my lan security zone lan and eth3 public ip it is my outside zone okay so friends here we will check reachability from site a public ip to side view public ip okay we should have reachability checking source source will be my source interface 1.1.1 and host 5.5.5.1 okay so you can see it's pinging means we have connectivity here okay so let's start configuration so here is my steps we are going to configure step 1 we will create a tunnel interface आई की क्रिप्टो फेस वन पैरामीटर एंड स्टेप थ्री आई की फेस वन गेटवे एंड स्टेप फोर विल कॉन्फिगर आई पी से क्रिप्टो मेथड फेस टू एंड स्टेप फाइव एसाइन आई की गेटवे एंड आई पी से प्रोफाइल टू टनल इंटरफेस विच वी हैव क्रिएटेड एब ओयर ओके देन विल कॉन्फिगर राउट टूअर्ड्स टनल दैन कॉन्फिगर पॉलिसी ओके ट्वेल्व आवर सेलेक्टर्स so in step 1 we will create a tunnel interface okay so friends to configure tunnel interface click on network then click on interface here then you can see tunnel okay tunnel click here to add now tunnel interface id will be 1 okay so now here we will define virtual router default okay security zone will create new security zone here vpn okay now click on okay vpn zone now click on okay so you can see we have created tunnel interface here okay now step 2 step 2 will configure ik crypto face on parameters okay in the network section you can see network profiles there is option is ike e crypto okay just click here ike e crypto so you can see we have a default parameter as 128 cvc 3ds seven okay we can create our parameter here ike let's ike face on parameter so we can define ds group to encryption method will be ds ओके एंड ऑथेंटिकेशन मेथड विल बी सावन और एम डी फाइव विल टेक सावन लाइफ टाइम विल बी एट आवर्स ओके आई की ओरिजिन टू एट आवर्स ओके यू कैन मॉडिफाई इट विल कीप इट रिमेन सेम नाउ क्लिक ऑन ओके ओके सो वी हैव क्रिएटेड आई की फेस ऑन पैरामीटर्स नाउ फ्रेंड्स थर्ड मेथड विल कॉन्फिगर आई की फेस ऑन गेटवे ओके क्लिक हेयर आई की गेट वे नाउ क्लिक ऑन एड आई की गेट वे ओके आई की गेट वे नाउ विल सेलेक्ट हेयर वर्जन वर्जन ऑन वन इंटरफेस माई इंटरफेस विल बी वन स्लेस थ्री सो इन माई केस माई एक्सटर्नल इंटरफेस वन स्लेस थ्री एंड माई लोकल आई डी वन डॉट वन डॉट वन ओके सो माई लोकल आई पी 
1.1.1.1 and PRIP 5.5.5.1 okay 1 now I have to assign preset key preset key here so preset key now click on advanced option so if you will enable passive mode so it will be only responder and, and never will really going to initiate the traffic okay so if your firewall behind the net device then you can select here net trojan net t enable okay so exchange mode exchange mode main mode aggressive mode we can keep it main mode okay now we have to assign here ik crypto profile which we have created here okay so ik crypto profile i have configured I keep fashion parameter here okay now dpd not going to enable now click on okay so we have configured ip key gateway now we'll create configure ipsec crypto method phase 2 okay now click here ipsec crypto so you can see already predefined suits here methods so we can create your own method Fashion IPsec crypto okay IPsec crypto phase 2 okay now here we'll select protocol ESP okay encryption method will be DES authentication method will be SA1 okay we have to remember this setting so same setting should be the peer firewall okay development group no pfs will select no pfs here okay now click on okay so friends we have created phase one parameters we have created phase two parameter now friends we have to assign i key gateway and ip crypto profile to ip tunnel okay so let's configure step five click here ip tunnel let's click here now click on add okay now now we'll provide the name site a site a ip tunnel now we'll select your uh, which you have created tunnel one interface now we have to define ik gateway which we have created ik gateway now then ipc crypto profile which you have created here ipc crypto phase 2 now click your proxy id in proxy id we can define our selector local gateway and peer gateway okay now different selectors interesting traffic here okay local my local traffic 10.1.1.0 and destination is 20.1.1.0 okay 0 slash 24 and peer will be 20.1.1.0 slash 24 okay protocol any now click ok here so you can see we have configured ipsec tunnel successfully now now friends we have to configure policy routes let's go to configure route so just click here virtual router default route okay now go to the static route now click here add route will add ipsec side v route destination is 20.1.1.0 slash 24 and interface will be my tunnel interface okay so next hope will be ip address none okay we have provided already tunnel interface so for this subnet traffic will pass through the tunnel okay so now click on okay okay we have configured routes now we have to create policy now friends we have to configure policy to allow traffic this subnet 10.1.0 to 20.20 okay site a so source source zone will be lan and source address will be 10. 1.1.0 slash 24 okay send destination destination zone will be outside 
and destination address will be 20.1.1.0 slash 24 okay so application will be any service url any action will be allowed and log at session end okay now click on okay so friends we have done all the steps now just click here to commit and commit here okay now policy committed successfully now we have configured ipsec vpn on site a firewall okay now we will configure ipsec vpn on side b firewall let's go to side b firewall so here we have configured interfaces already and routes now what to do so in first step we'll create a tunnel interface then ik crypto same as side a firewall okay so interface then click here tunnel tunnel interface will be one okay default zone default zone will create new zone here okay zone vpn and click on okay now click on okay here we have created tunnel now we'll create ik crypto so friends same ik parameter will be here as we have created in site firewall okay so just click here add i key parameter okay fashion parameter so dh group you have selected two and in authentication method seven encryption method ds and lifetime which eight hour okay now click on okay now let's go to ik gateway ik gateway gateway interface is my outside interface 1 slash 3 and my local IP 5.5.1 and PRIP 1.1.1 ok so local IP 5.1 and PRIP is 1.1.1.1 ok so preset key same age same we have configured on site firewall should be same here local identification no need to do just click on advanced option here so exchange mode will be main mode and i key crypto profile i key crypto profile we have created fashion parameter so that we are dpd not enabled just now click on ok so we have created i key crypto and i key gateway now create ipc crypto click here add we will not going to select here default because we have select configure manually in site firewall so phase 2 so encryption method we have configured des authentication method and seven and group 2 def element not going to select no pfs okay now click on enable okay so we have created phase 2 parameters now go to the ipx external click here add now tunnel side b okay side b so tunnel interface we have created one okay ik gateway it will define ik gateway here it will define ipc crypto profile proxy id so proxy id we have to configure okay so for this local id local will be 20 and a remote will be 10 for side b okay 20.1.1.0 slash 24 and remote will be 10.1.1.0 slash 24 protocol any okay now click here okay so we have we have created ipx external here okay we have to configure route here to allow traffic via tunnel interface click here default now static route add a physics it destination will be 10.1.1.0 slash 24 
it will be pass through interface will be tunnel interface so interface will be tunnel interface ip sec ip address none okay traffic will pass through tunnel interface okay now click on okay so created so now we'll create policy here just create policy so allow traffic from site a to site b okay source will be vpn okay zone and destination will be LAN zone okay so let's create policy okay site a to site b ipsec to allow traffic from site a now click on add interface source zone will be vpn okay so source address will be 10.1.1.0 slash 24 so destination will be destination zone will be LAN and destination IP 20.1.1.0 slash 24 ok now application any service any action allow and ok now commit here on the commit on side view firewall so you can see traffic will come from the site a to side view then it will hit on vpn zone and source address will be 10.0 source 10.0 destination is will be 20 ok now click on commit uh, meanwhile we'll check from the site a firewall one mistake we have done in site a policy okay so you can see site a policy should be LAN to VPN zone okay so we have to select here outside zone will be here my zone will be VPN okay because my tunnel interface is belong from VPN zone okay now let's commit now committed successfully and here both committed successfully now friends let's go to tunnel status check the tunnel status here network and ipsec tunnel so you can see ipsec tunnel is still down phase 1 and phase 2 both down so what to do here so friends here to bring up phase 1 and phase 2 we have to manually initiate traffic from this firewall okay let's go to cli now we'll initiate traffic test vpn ik sa gateway gateway will be ik gateway okay now press enter so initiated let's refresh it okay now you can see phase 1 is came up okay so let's see check the on the side view firewall ipsec tunnel so you can see phase 1 is up phase 1 up here phase 1 is up here now now friends so let's initiate traffic from site a okay ping 20.1.1.10 okay it should be ping should be ping should be ping should be ping okay now you can see it's started pinging okay so now you can see phase 2 and phase 1 both is up now let's check here refresh it so you can see phase 1 and phase 2 both is up so now let's check tunnel info so local 1.1.1 peer 5.5.1 remote ip 20.1.0 okay packet encrypted packet is 13 decrypt packet 12 byte encryption is in a byte encryption 1560 okay so you can see we have successfully configured ipsec vpn between follow to firewall okay so friends in this video we have seen how to configure ipsec vpn between two Palo Alto firewall so thanks for watching this video have a nice day